Hi everybody, welcome back to another awesome day, another awesome vlog. Happy Thanksgiving, the day this is being posted is Thanksgiving Day. I hope you guys have some amazing plans and enjoy a special day with your friends and family. Today, I'm gonna show you how to make this delicious spinach and artichoke cheese ball, and then I'm gonna show you how to magically turn it into a turkey. Let's get started. We are having a fun potluck lunch at my work. So I decided I'd go on Pinterest, find a recipe, and make a fun appetizer. That's what I signed up for. So I have decided to make a spinach artichoke cheese ball. For this recipe, you're gonna need tortilla chips, stick pretzels, 14 ounces of artichoke hearts in water, lemon, 14 ounces of cream cheese, frozen chopped spinach, thawed, minced garlic, and just a touch of salt. The first thing I'm gonna do is drain my artichokes and chop them up. As I chop them, I'm gonna put them in a bowl. The next thing I'm gonna do is take my chopped spinach and I'm going to put it in a paper towel and squeeze all of the water out, or as much as possible anyway, and then I'm going to make sure that's chopped up into small, tiny pieces as well. Next, I'm gonna add my cream cheese into the bowl. I'm gonna cut my lemon. I need one teaspoon lemon. And I'm gonna add a teaspoon and a half of minced garlic. I am going to use a handheld mixer and mix this up. I'm gonna lay out some plastic wrap. And this is what I'm gonna use to shape my cheese ball while it hardens in the refrigerator. I thought I was your cheese ball. <laughs> you are my cheese ball, but I've already shaped you just fine. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to work it into a ball. And I'm gonna wrap it up and put it in the refrigerator for two, for two hours so that it can harden. And I'll be back after that. So next I've taken some leftover candy from Halloween. I have a Tootsie Roll stick I'm going to use as the head. And I'm just gonna spread it out a little bit to make room to add two eyes for my turkey. I've warmed them up in the microwave. I've warmed this Tootsie Roll up in the microwave just to make it a little more pliable. The next thing I'm going to add is a Swedish fish off to the side like that. And the third thing I'm gonna take is a piece of orange Tootsie Roll and I'm going to turn it into a little triangle nose for my turkey. I've just warmed them up for about 20 seconds in the microwave. I did 10 seconds, turned them over and did 10 seconds just on a paper towel, just so that I could give them a little pliability. And then I have a little bit of white Tootsie Roll that I actually am going to use to put behind my whoppers that I have as eyes. So I'm gonna shape these as two round eyes connected in the middle. And then I'm gonna stick my whoppers on like so. And now I have a cute little turkey face. So I'm gonna put this in the refrigerator to harden while I finish the rest. Next, I'm gonna take my cheese ball and unwrap it, and I'm going to put it on the platter that I intend to serve it on, and I'm gonna start with my pretzel sticks. I'm just gonna put a handful out on my platter to work with, and I'm gonna start making a row of what would look like 
feathers in my turkey. I'm now going to make a second row and spread them out a little bit further and make them stick up a little bit higher. And this is what we have so far. I'm now gonna do a third row and go out even further. Next thing I'm gonna use are my tortilla chips. And I'm just going to stick some in the sides, but start placing them around my turkey. My turkey head has had enough time to harden, so now I'm going to put it in my cheese ball. This is our finished product. I think that he turned out really, really cute, and I hope it tastes delicious. I hope you guys have an amazing Thanksgiving. I hope you enjoyed our video. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button, and don't forget to subscribe. Bye! So at your house, you made this cake? Yes. You actually baked it and made I it and it, made frosted it. it. Frosted it. Yeah. So this is Danielle's dessert for our <laughs> potluck and she's decorating <laughs> it with these beautiful flowers that hopefully are safe to eat. I think they are. I think they are too. <laughs> Tell us a little bit about yourself. <laughs> I enjoy making cakes and long walks on the beach. <laughs> and Mia, where's your... Oh, there, yours is hidden My behind flowers. Is so Mia made... Delicious homemade that looks so good. mac and cheese. Very cheesy. Very delicious. Good. And Walter brought in some delicious some cheesecake. Cheesecake. All right, we're doing good so far. Lots of snacks. All right, here's the final cake, which I turned out beautiful. Got sugar. What did you bring? I brought some crawfish dressing. Oh, that's right. Where is it? In the fridge? No, I have to get it out of the car. Oh, I know. I had to go get mine out too. Hey, excuse me. Come back here. What did you bring? Corn casserole and lovely bread. All right, we're going to have a delicious potluck for Thanksgiving.